Previously on X Men. Yo, welcome back. Okay, so episode 11. Um, episode 10, we got our ass kicked. So we went back, we're back in, got the team assembled, and we're going to try this again. So it's your boy Augie, Reality Comics Gaming. Uh, we're going to see if we can redeem ourselves. Um, it wasn't too good the last time, so here we go. We're back in. Uh, we took a different route this time, so we're not in the same place as we where we died, but we're still in the tunnels. We're still fi fighting these annoying ass creatures and people. So let's see how, how well we do. Off the bat, just start with some Circuit Fury. Ain't got time for none of this. Ooh, ooh, get him. Ooh, kill him. Give her that work. There we go. Don't even give her a chance to get up. Oh shit, this boy's sliding down. Okay. Anybody else coming down? I think they got the message. Oh, no, no, maybe not. Maybe not on this side. This side, they got all kinds of time. God, leave my guy. Die. We good? Okay. All right, we got a loot box. Yeah, I might as well just grab this. All right. All right, Ella stairs it is. I mean, not stairs, but you know what I mean. All right, so we are now on street level. Still trying to find Sebastian Shaw. person is this and honestly I, I gotta give it to this game the way it switches up the environments on you so that nothing ever feels the same or gets stale is really nice because we've been to the savage land we've been to weapon x factory we've been to a couple of different places sewers now we're in new york city the iconic new york city well at least the marvel new york city and i believe somewhere around here is where we meet deadpool Ah, look at Shaw, just standing there. Don't move a muscle. Unless you want to discover which of you has the best mutant healing powers. <laughs> no doubt you want information like Angel used to. A pity he was captured by Apocalypse. Well, my friends, you've come at a most opportune time. I'm being forced to vacate town as soon as possible. But before I go... I need tech bits, a hollow disc, and my master key. Get me those items and I'll tell you anything you want to know. How should I bloody know? I have stashes all over New York. Maybe you can locate those. Once you have those items, meet me back at the X Mansion. It's my business to know everything. You're bloody right you will. Later, mates. Ah, uh, the classic you early 2000s no. game design of Fetch Quests has struck again. Here we are, questing for fetches. Oh shit, that... They got a Nightcrawler? Uh... Clone over here. Oh shit, Kerr's not gonna be happy about that. Alright, let's go ahead and save. Cause, yeah. Reasons. Alright, let's keep going. Ah, 
Oh, okay. Oh, good job, Bishop. Push on mean streets of New York. Oh no. Come on, Rogue. He handled that. down here. No, we cannot. Get him! Ooh, that sounded tough. Get him! Why you getting your ass, getting your ass beat? Talk about get him. Boy, why are you running? There we go. Uppercut. All right, here's one of his tech bits. Okay, so we got one stash. Defend yourself. See that? Damn, Rogue smacked the shit out of him. Oh, that's a lot of men down. All right, let's let's just kind of comb through, wipe everybody off of this map first before we move forward. I do see that we're about to hit a some sort of uh, marker for an objective, so. Let's get as much damage and XP as we can. And then let's press on. Got one last person to farm. Get a jump four on one, man. Here we go. All right, let's get up there. Oh, my dumbass. There's just there's literally stairs right here. <laughs> You're mine. Ooh. Uh, I guess not. That that did not last as long as I thought it would. Ah, uh, hit him with the super combo, baby. We're doing pretty good as far as uniences go. Alright, now we got one more item to grab. And we can go meet Sebastian Shaw and get some answers from that man. Wow, these things made it to service level. That's a first. up. And Rogue. Oh, 
okay, now we got the whole team powered up. That's what we talking about, baby. Let's take a look at that. Let's go ahead and let's go to stats. We got four to spend on Wolverine. Let's put that on speed and focus. Let's put this, uh, let's put this on lethal lunge because I'm loving that move so far. And is there anything we can use? No, not yet. Let's go to Jubilee. Jubilee, let's go ahead and get your strikes up some more because I like you as a striker. Even though you're not a striker by nature, but hey, you are my Jubilee, not the Jubilee. So uh, let's go. Let's get body up. There we go. Let's spend this last point. Let's spend it on something useful. Let's go. Uh, hmm, absorption. There you go. And then Rogue, let's add this to your heal. Let's go to your stats. Let's go to your body and focus. And I think we are good. Jump back into the action. Team is set up, and now we can press forward. There we go. Oh, now he comes in blue now? Okay, don't matter. These hands are rated E for everybody. Damn. They fucking him up. Loot, baby. All right. Okay, look at that. We found another danger room. I'm just gonna grab this. Now, is there anything back here we need to grab? Let's Got grab it. Rogue and Dutrier just for quick reconnaissance. Target confirmed. Oh, look at that. Look at that. Somebody need their ass with. real quick. We got time for all these antics. Here we go. Alright, so before we go that direction, let's just go back to where we were going and make sure there's nothing we've missed because, sure you know, just completionist sake. This is a legitimate dead end. Defend yourself. Oh, so well, you can't touch me. Oh, look at that. Nice try, though. Ah, shit. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Ah, oh, y'all getting worked. Rogue just took out the entire battalion. Man, you pretty damn good, Rogue. It's just, you can't fight for shit. Ooh. 
Like Wolverine's lunge, but with more flair to it. Nice. Man, do you believe you quit talking and keep fighting? So I don't take your ass anywhere. Can never focus. There we go. All right, infinity uniforms. Okay. I guess we gotta sneak in as these people eventually. Alright, Bishop, let's go. Yeah, it's look for that street justice. I don't have enough. Come on, man. There we go. Put your hands up. No, fuck that. Put your hands up. Damn. All right. We are getting close to that secret X. Let's switch into our. <laughs> Look at that! Look at that! About to walk in as as the, as the op. Uh, hey guys, uh, what's going on here? Don't mind me. I'm gonna grab this thing right quick. What do you quick. think you're doing with that holodisc? Digging into Apocalypse. Apocalypse has already been informed of the disc. He wasn't interested in seeing it. Uh, he changed his mind? Apocalypse changed his mind? That'd be a first. What are you really doing here? Ah, what do you fuck think it. you're doing with that holodisc? <laughs> a surprise inspection? Why? He's never done that before. What's your identification code? What do you think you're doing with that? Alright, fuck it. Damn, he didn't even last a sec. He got his ass beat right away. All them questionings. Should have spent more time on your hands than your lip. We got him. I don't know who I'm fighting, but Bishop did. Uh, hey, buddy, you want to get up? Well, at least as he's pretending to be one of them, so they should hopefully look past his body, and we can uh, get him back later. Yep, we can't revive him. Bishop is officially down for the count. But that's fine. We'll push on, we're gonna get to the rest of this, and hopefully we'll find a... Uh, Actually, let's look for one real quick. Is there an, any? Nope, nope. Just got ops. Just got people to fight. That's it. That's all we find in this game. People that need their ass beat and people to beat their ass. Ooh. Let's do that again. That pop was clean. That would have been a super clean combo. Hey, man, could be so fucking passive and just fight. But uh, we still got one more person left. There we go. 
All right, let's see. Is there anything? Ah, just more hands to give. Out ah, here, giving them charity hands. That was fun. It sure was, Luann. What have we here? There's clearly, people trying to fight you. Jubilee, you may not be going on other missions after this because you are quite useless. Got it. Huh? Enemy unit sighted. Man, enemy unit about to kick your ass. Wolverine, let's go. Look at here, a dead body. still a blast when you when you design a game the right way it doesn't matter how long or when you play it it's still a fantastic game whoever like the team that made this i hope they're still in the business because man this shit is this is some of the best x-men fun you can have to date and it's been 19 years i don't think there's been an x-men game that can top this as of right now x-men legends 2 as a video game dedicated strictly to the X-Men is still number one. Like the X-Men have shown up in other games, but I don't think any game has given them the reverence, lore, and just attention to detail that X-Men Legends 2 did. This game is damn I'm, I'm glad to play this little game now, man. I'm glad I can still play it. I'm glad the modding community is still behind this. Because this game just, just doesn't get old. Now, 
like say what you will about the graphic even the graphics feel good because it's, it's a it's a cartoony feel on a cartoony subject like it'd be one thing if it was like bruce lee and chuck norris but this is x-men so you expect it to look fun and on a current modern pc the crispness of the image still like everything they did in 2005 really holds up and yeah i mean the game is being run on a much more powerful gpu but the the, the assets they made back then still hold up because the gpu can't make new assets so whatever the assets are is what the assets are man this is gorgeous Oh, it sure is, girl. It sure is. Next to X-Men 97 and the original X-Men cartoons, this, this is, this is good. And then to have, like, Wolverine just, oh, man. This is gonna be sweet. Ooh. Red him into Swiss. Jeez. Alright, let's get this let's get this concept sketchbook. Can't go that direction. Alright, so where can we go? I think we we've exhausted all of our abilities to go places. Can go here. Oh, stay where you are. Oh, come on, buddy. Ooh, that had to hurt. And stay where you are, really. Best you got. Can't go that direction. Can't go here either. So where are we supposed to go? Uh. Let's take a look at our objectives real quick. Did we get everything for Sebastian Shaw? Okay, so we got everything we need. We just gotta go back to the X Mansion, it looks like. So let's go ahead and just call Blink and have her create a portal for us. Just look like we got everything. And there is Sebastian Shaw. All right, let's get some, some answers here. Now, let's go grab Emma Frost because obviously Sebastian Shaw and Emma Frost have some history. But first, let's save. And then let's go ahead and change our team. Let's just put Cyclops in this position. Actually, I'm sorry, Emma Frost. And we're not even going to play with her. We're just going to see if this conversation triggers. Because she should be the one that a conversation triggers for when it comes to Sebastian Shaw. Let's see if that is still true. Here we are, the tech bits, the hollow disk, and my master key. All is in order. My, my, you can be forceful when you want to. Here, take the master key. It's all you'll need to enter the tower. You'll find an entrance to the North Sewers in Manhattan. This key opens that entrance. From there, it's just a matter of following the sewers to the Tower of Apocalypse. If you do make it into the tower, would you do me the favor of freeing the Black Queen? I think she's being kept prisoner there. Knowing her, she was trying to make a deal with Apocalypse. That Selene is a woman after my own heart. Always playing both sides against the middle. Ha ha ha! 
It's an association of some of the most powerful men and women alive. Our goal is to help mold the future. Your question should be, what do the X-Men have against us? Several times they've taken it upon themselves to thwart our attempts at improving the economy. How I managed to obtain it is better left unsaid. But originally it belonged to Apocalypse's right-hand man, Mr. Sinister. Apocalypse has no knowledge of the door. It was built by Mr. Sinister. Oh, my friend. Sinister is constantly hatching new schemes. And Apocalypse realizes it. He just tries to keep one step ahead. So long as there's a profit to be made, I'm glad to be of service, X-Man. Alright, so there was no conversation to be had, which sucks. But I wish there was. Let's go ahead and change Emma Frost out here because we don't really need Emma Frost. Let's bring, uh, who haven't we used in a while? Let's bring Gambit. Or Gambit, uh, let's see, Nightcrawler. Nightcrawler. Yeah, let's bring Kirk. We haven't used Kirk in a while. Let's go ahead and level up Kirk here. Let's, uh, let's give him... And then let's add that to his speed. And then let's get through his strikes. And then Blade. Critical strikes, gear, nothing really in gear that we need to give him. Let's go ahead and improve Rogue with just one ability to use. Let's do critical strike. And then we'll just add that to focus. And then Jubilee, let's go body. And let's put that in your Independence Day. I guess we can't. Uh, pep Rally, okay. We're going to switch out Jubilee because, well, honestly, she's not a real person to really want to use too long in a, in a fight like this. She's just there. Uh, so let's go with, uh, let's, let's bring in Cable. Let's see if he does, if he does better than, uh, than Bishop did. Let's go ahead and put a lot on strike. It's gonna be a weak boy, but he is what we need. Can't give him that. Can't give him any of these. Actually, hold on. His uniform. Uniform is thirty. Jesus. Nice. All right. So we got Wolverine, Kurt, Rogue, and Cable. A weird assortment of X-Men, but a team nonetheless. Let's go ahead and save. And let's go talk to the Professor, because we got a mission with with Havoc here. Right. Quick, there's not much time. They need us to disable the defense platforms Apocalypse has placed along the coast. A group of sentinels are being sent to pick up New York refugees, but those platforms will destroy anything that flies by. Bolivar Trask himself has put in overrides and blocked their mutant killing programs. They should completely ignore mutants. If you want more info on this mission, use the briefing computer by Professor Xavier. He's the one who developed Sentinels, so make no mistake, he has no love for mutants. As a matter of fact, he'd prefer we were all dead. The West Coast ain't got love for Tupac. He tried, and now 50 of his fantastic mutant killing robots lay at the bottom of the ocean. They're no match for the defenses of the platforms. They're a group of New York residents that managed to escape prison set up by Apocalypse. Word has it, a mutant set hundreds free before he was captured. From the sounds of it, that mutant was Banshee. 
Ah, a classic X-Man. Even a founding font uh, member in some time in some of the uh, X-Men lore. Banshee, that's just a temporary situation. He'll figure a way out. He always does. Oh, <laughs> that would be an incredibly bad move. Could you imagine how he'd take being saved? No, he'll find a way out. If you really want to thank me, put in a good word with Xavier for me. All right, let's go talk to Xavier and let him know that old boy has been doing well. Damn, they really fucked this place up. You know, before we well, go, let's just talk to Forge. Back. Let's got some equipment. Can never be too stocked on these kind of missions. In Genosha, we saw Apocalypse was willing to drown the city's populace at the first threat of attack. We cannot allow that to happen in New York. Therefore, once you reach the command level, I'll be sending Beast up to meet you. He'll be operating the consoles and making sure no evil schemes are afoot. If you'd like more information on this, use the mission briefing computer. My pleasure. All right, let's... Which mission briefing would you like? Let's go help with... The platform. We already found Sebastian. He's already here. Greetings. It seems we have a mission of mercy to carry out. To the north of us, Apocalypse's military is driving several hundred humans toward the ocean. It's just a matter of time before they're captured. Magneto, we're not equipped to handle an evacuation that big. Bolivar Trask is. The man who invented Sentinels? Yes, that Bolivar Trask. He's using a fleet of his sentinels as an airlift for the refugees. So why do we care? Let the sentinels save them. The problem is, Apocalypse has set up a series of defensive platforms along the coast. Those platforms will destroy any sentinel that comes near. I'm guessing they want us to take out the platforms so the sentinels have a clear path. That is correct, Cyclops. But the sentinels are going to attack as soon as we're in their sights. Great! So we wind up fighting both Apocalypse's men and Sentinels. Not this time. The programming's been rewritten such that, to them, we'll look exactly like humans. Uh, is anyone else here getting that this is a recipe for disaster feeling? I would have thought an X-Man would jump at a chance to do a good deed such as this. Oh, I'll do it. But you all better be prepared for a big I told you so if something goes haywire, huh? Thank you for that thrilling insight. If there are no further questions, be on your way. Alright. Let's jump on the... Well, actually, Iceman. Bobby was talking, so do we need Bobby for this? You know what? Let's start the mission without Bobby, and then if we need, we will bring him on. Are you sure you want to go to the platforms? Yep, take him to the platforms, bro. I'm getting out of here. There's way too many anti-aircraft guns on these platforms. Thank you, Havoc. You braved a great deal to get the team to the landing zone. And because the platforms are much more heavily fortified than first believed, I've requested the aid of S.H.I.E.L.D. They can better secure the structures once the defenses are down. Plus, they have a more thorough reconnaissance of the area. And with that, I hand control of this mission over to Colonel Nick Fury. Thank you, Professor Xavier. Team, some of you I've worked with before, others of you I've fought with, but lives are on the line, so there's no time for egos right now. At this very moment, a team of S.H.I.E.L.D. agents are on their way to your location. It is imperative that you destroy the anti-aircraft guns before my men arrive. If you don't, they'll be shot out of the sky. Time is the enemy here. Move fast, Fury out. All right, Samuel L. Jackson. Team, those anti-aircraft guns are almost indestructible. 
The only way you're going to hurt them is by destroying the generator that powers them. All right, generator first, then guns. So we'll just make our way straight to the center and work on destroying the generator. All right, generator's down. got a timer working against us in the bottom lower right corner you may not be able to see because I'm in the way but we got two minutes and 28 seconds to destroy them guns I enjoy this too much all right Kurt don't, don't, don't get hard Shit, you're destroying stuff always some suspect shit come out of his mouth oh I'm enjoying this to these danger danger system override in progress override complete original programming reinitialized Destroy all mutant life forms. Watch out, team! Someone or something is resetting the Sentinels to their original programming. Defend yourselves! Thank you, Samuel. There we go. Yeah, that didn't really de need a lot of defending. One hitter quitter. We followed you. Speaking of defending ourselves, let's just come down. Let's destroy this. Let y'all take care of that fight. Get some of this loot. Then we'll fly away. Because we ain't got time for all that. Oh shit. Dang, bro, fucking everybody up. All right, come on, we ain't got time to be fighting everybody. We just gotta, we gotta escape. Much we really aren't breaking a sweat though.
Warning, offensive system activated. Ah, oh, man. I was really hoping to kick him down, but it's all the same. Sending over fucking everywhere. Oh, to the chest. Big dog. You know what? Let's not even find out. Let's get the fuck out. Boom, bitch. Team, meet Sergeant Charles Kilroy. He's the demolition specialist who's going to take out those radar arrays. Protect him at all costs. Thanks, Colonel Fury. If it weren't for that high-tech scuba gear, I never would have made it here alive. You're the only man who could have done it, Kilroy. Now make me proud, son, and take out those radar rays. Yes, sir. All right, team. Lead the way. All right, Charlie. There's a radar array. It's going to take a little while to set the charge, so keep me alive long enough to do it. Don't let me die. He said, don't let me die. He's already doubting us. My boy, we the X-Men. We die, not you. Sentinels are definitely weaker than X Men Legends 1, but then again, these aren't the main protagonists, I mean, antagonists of the game, so. Well, I guess it's a different protagonist depending on who's really you're playing as. There we go. Well, isn't that a pretty sight? Good job, Charlie. Well done, Sergeant, and good job, team. Shield agents will now secure the platform. You're free to move on to the next radar ring. Do wheel, damn, them boys don't play. Scanners have located mutant DNA. Damn, look at them go. We mean business. We're not about it. Damn, Sentinels are like, fuck it, we gonna fuck them up. You just keep coming. Must be a glitch. This has to be a glitch. Ain't no way. Ain't no way all these sentinels are flying in. We're about to lose, old boy. Oh my god. Man, we trying to protect you, bruh. There are way too many sentinels coming in. We gotta run, man. We ain't gonna make it. We gotta run.
do not engage the sentinels. Boys don't. They, they, they ain't playing fair. All right. So we're going to stop right here. And we're going to go make a blink portal because uh, blink portal is down. Anywho, we're going to stop right here because we need to pay some bills. And clearly we are not sponsored by anybody. So we have to go find sponsors on our own. Uh, so come back. Episode 12. We will continue the platform mission with the team as constructed. It's your boy, Augie. If you like what you're watching, please leave a like, subscribe, leave a comment. Tell me what you're liking. Tell me what you're playing. Anyone playing Ghost of Tsushima yet on a PC? Uh, let me know what you guys are up to, man. Anyway, it's your boy, Augie. I appreciate you watching this. See you in the next one. Peace.